what about, uh, did you bring your mom with you to New York? Because I know she's here with you. No, unfortunately, uh, she didn't want to come, so. But is she here today? No, she's not here today. She, uh, I invited her to come because I wanted to She's coming to tomorrow's show, you know. She booked tickets. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. Well, there you go. My well, mom's always like that. She, she's a big fan of mine. She, she is. She is. But she, doesn't, she just doesn't want to be on camera. Like, I try to bring her over, and like, she scheduled an MRI today just so she doesn't have to be here. <laughs> so insulted. I, I know. I'm a, <laughs> but good thing she'll be here tomorrow, I guess. Uh, when I'm not around. <laughs> right. Well, I'm looking forward to seeing her. <laughs> Last time you were here, we talked about dating. Yes. And you were, you know, getting back out yeah. there and... Uh, not much has changed, yeah. <laughs> come on. You, what would be, if you could describe, like, the, the perfect mate for you... Would, like, there's girls that wrote in last time you were here. Yeah. They were like, I will date him. It's, it's great, but it's like, I've never met them before, and they want to marry me immediately. It's like, eh, through well, Facebook, not the best way to... Uh, no, that's a, that's a red flag. Uh, that's like, a red flag. Uh, yeah. But what would, if you could describe the woman, would it be like, what would be the top qualities? Uh, probably like a, a hot, nerdy girl with a, with a great smile. A hot, nerdy girl with a great smile. I think that's an uh, that's a good uh, yeah, it's, description. It's definitely all about the personality, but you know, it's a uh, yeah, right. Someone, so, look, <laughs> no, no, I'm, I'm not, like like you, you know, a, a hot, nerdy girl. Oh, uh, that's very yeah. sweet. But someone with a great smile, because you know, I I like to make people laugh, and you know, it's, it's great. You know, if they'll laugh and have great. Don't smile. you think that that's like the most seductive thing if somebody's laughing at your jokes? Oh God, yes. Yeah, I, men love that if a girl laughs their joke. Absolutely. Especially if she laughs like this. <laughs> right? Come on, come on. Let's go, let's, let's go. go. But in, what, are, you, are you one of those guys that likes um, baby talk? You know, every like, time I see these girls on these reality shows, they're like, honey, I got your cuckoo, caca, night, night, ba, ba, ba. I'm like, what is that? What is that? And why does it work? It works. Does it? Yes! Ladies, am I right? Don't you see women talk like that in the reality? You're like, honey, I got your coach, your pop, 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 pop. Uh, I'm like, just tickle her and be done with it. <laughs> but didn't you, you found your old girlfriend on Facebook. Uh, yeah, I mean, she, I mean, we're still Facebook friends, but uh, I, I found Facebook out. Facebook friends? What does that mean? You were going out and now you're Facebook friends? No, no, we've always been Facebook friends. You just don't drop them. But I just found out that she got engaged, which is great. That's always fun. How did you find out? Uh, through Facebook. No. <laughs> Isn't it great? Mossy. Well, that, that's a, I mean, pe you, you find Why didn't you take her off the Facebook? I mean, not, I in, not in vengeance, but to say this is healthier for me. Nah, that's all right. I mean, people can still be friends, but. I know they can, but only if it makes you feel good inside your heart and your tummy. I feel like I need a pacifier. Like I know, that. really. Yeah. And, all right, just to, I want, I want to do a little help for you on your Facebook and your profile, okay, okay. because I think there's something people should know. You work with the Red Cross. Yes. Okay, well, this is a really, an added quality to your already fantasticness. Tell us uh, a little bit about much. it. Well, I'm part of the National Celebrity Cabinet, and basically we go out and spread the word and part of the uh, Give a Gift That Saves a Day campaign. And, you know, I play a hero on TV, but I want to encourage everyone else to be everyday heroes by just right. going out, going to redcross.org and, uh, you know, donate time. Donate, uh, donate your blood. It you know it takes about an hour, and get orange juice and cookies, which is nice. You know, <laughs> hey, some some incentive, right? Yeah, yeah. No, but it, but it's great, you know, because Red Cross is such a great organization. You know, they help you know people in need. You know, in, any disaster. If your neighbor's house is burning, if a child needs a hug, they're right. there. Right, they and, are there. That's what you always see. I mean, as long as I can remember, that's that they're always there. Yeah. And they're such an established organization, and you right. trust them. So mm -hmm. maybe you'll meet a nice girl there. At a disaster relief. <laughs> Just think of it this way, if you start with a disaster, you can only go up. Uh, that, that, that's just very true. Cool. Well, you can go to BonnieHunt.com for more information on the Red Press. You can see Heroes Monday Nights on NBC. Thank you so much, Mossy, for being here. You always enjoy.